you have anything for Joseph? Oh yeah, I had the timing right. Did you? Yeah. So the lap before we crossed the line, and my nose was slightly in front of his, and that was going to finish. There was no way it was going to finish in single file. But uh, yeah, racing gods had other plans. But uh, I have to say to the guys, it's been a hell of a start to the year. Um, I had a rocket. Like, I don't think there's another way to put it. I was really comfortable in the car, and it was it was fun. I have to say, like it was, it's gotta be the best Texas race in the last four or five years. It was great. Um, yeah. It was freaking awesome, and uh, really, really nice that I got to drive or not drive, but race with with guys that I have so much respect for, Alex, Joseph. Um, you know, they you can re you you can push it to the limit. But you always give each other the room that you need, and, and I think that's that's what we gave the fans. That's what they deserve. Alex, uh, take us back that uh, that final restart uh, when you got around Pato, and then you had to battle Joseph. Uh, it was obviously Joseph getting around you. I think it was like 242 or something like that. Just your thoughts on that, on what you had there at that final restart, and then trying to keep Joseph at bay. Yeah, I'm. Touch it. Tick, tick, tick. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm super happy. Um, really, really happy as if I won today. Um, honestly, I didn't not expect that. It's a place that I struggled a lot in, in the past. Um, but yesterday I felt confident and also today as, as the race started, I felt like the car was good. Um, honestly, I don't think we had the speed um, that the five and the two had. Um, I still tried, uh, but I knew that they had a uh, little bit better tires uh, and that they had a bit more speed. But it was a um, hell of a race. I had a lot of fun with most of the drivers, not with everybody. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, you were not. Specifically? Huh? Specifically? No, no, not specifically. It's, but too, it's too early on the season. Yeah. <laughs> 100 days once it. Yeah, I'll tell them. Um, so yeah, I, I had a lot of fun. I, I agree with Pato that it was really fun when you had uh, a driver uh, that you could trust and hopefully we gave the fans what they deserved. Um, but yeah, super, super excited of the race that we did in the number 10 car. Pato talked a little bit about uh, just the respect that the three of you had uh, and a couple of the guys battling the top five uh, for everyone and knowing that you know you could push it a little bit but still you got room to, to do what you need to do. Yeah, that's how it has to be. There's really no other way to do it. Um, you're going way too fast for to uh, to mess around at those speeds. Yeah. And um, yeah, I mean it's well, what, we're going wheel to wheel like 226 miles an hour or something. Like it's a little wiggle from somebody can can be really big. So um, hats off to everybody. It's. It's pretty insane, I have to say. I know it might, I'm, I don't know how it looks. It must look cool, I'm assuming. <laughs> yeah, it looks insane, but inside of the car. Yeah, it was like three or four. Yeah, I mean, it's like you're going in, in, you see like two guys there, and then you're just like, okay, keep it in. It's just, it's commitment. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, this is Steven Stumpf. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Uh, check out the two videos beside me, and for more racing content, visit frontstretch.com.